guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. I'm Natalie, and today we are watching Firefly episode 4, Shindig. Welcome back to my channel, everybody. Thank you so much for being here, and welcome if you are new. Today we are getting into episode 4, and I'm actually watching this right after... I just filmed my Firefly episode 3 react for the second time. This is a first time watching, so I'm really excited, which is why I kind of just jumped right into filming this one, because I wanted to watch something new today that I hadn't seen. So, yes, I'm very excited to see what comes of this one. The thumbnail, it looks like some people are dressed up, so I'm wondering if there's like a party or something, because it's called Shindig. I'm wondering if there's going to be some dancing. That would be kind of fun. We are definitely flying through this series. I'm kind of sad because I know that there's only one season and there's not going to be any more. I mean, this was made so long ago. So it's kind of a bummer how quickly we're flying through it. But I'm really enjoying it so far and I'm really excited to watch this episode with you guys. I feel like the last episode, it was a lot more suspenseful, a lot more intense. So it'd be interesting to see if this one is a little bit more playful and fun just because of the name. But I feel like every episode has had a lot of action and been really intense, so this one will probably deliver more of the same. For those that love Firefly and would like to watch my full-length reactions to these episodes, you can catch those over on Patreon. I always link my Patreon in the description bar down below. Just full disclosure, you need your own copy to watch along with me. I post those in a watch-along style format for those who are curious. Additionally, I have also started streaming on Twitch. It's been a lot of fun. I basically just hang out chatting with you guys, getting to know this community a bit better, and I play some fun low-key games. So I'm starting to get into the gaming thing, um, and it's really fun. I really enjoy it. So if that's something that interests you, you can also find a link to my Twitch profile down in the description bar down below. I just said down twice. It's okay. Without any further ado, I am just ready to get right into it. So with that being said, grab a drink, grab a snack, and let's get into the series. Hey. Why is the pool virtual? Whoa. Oh. No, we're good. We're good. <laughs> uh. That guy was in uh, True Blood. He was like the priest in True Blood. Atherton Wing. Yeah, he's a regular, ain't he? Is Mal gonna be jealous? The only place I've seen something so nice is some of the things that Nora has. Well, Nora gets to wear whatever she wants. What are you gonna do in that rig? Blouse around the engine room? Be like a sheep walking on its hind legs. Oh, don't be mean. She's a girl. She wants to dress up sometimes. Who's this guy? Roger. Captain oh, God. Oh, God. At least he got rid of the stupid, like, tie around his neck without a collar, because that was driving me nuts. So what is it you need? Yeah. Good, man. Jane is so trusting. Like, I'll drink it, I'll eat it. No place it'll be. Safe place. Using some new tech gun scans. High class, too. I bet it's the thing that Anara's invited to. Are they literally doing fancy line dancing? Because this is a space western? Are you kidding me? <sighs> it looks like they were doing fancy line dancing. Or medieval dancing. I can't even tell. Maybe maybe that's not what they're doing. I don't know. All of them wish they were you. He creeps me out a lot. Not gonna lie. Not speaking to you, Captain. Got no need to speak. Come on, got a job for you. Are you gonna apologize to her, Mal? Better. Oh, wait. <gasps> I bet he's inviting her to this event and he got the dress for her. Because in the thumbnail, she was wearing that dress. You can live here on Persephone as my personal companion. Whoa. You're a generous man. That's but she doesn't nice. want that. Ha ha. Oh, 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 oh. Oh. Mal, you're supposed to hold her hand. Oh. She's so cute. Look at her. She's so happy. They both look so out of place. It's adorable. There's a red sash, crossbows. Why does he do that? Mm, oh, she's got a thing for strawberries. Eating steaks off a place made of solid money. Is she okay? Anything. What are you doing? Honey, 
What are you doing? Why are you tearing all the labels off? How are they gonna know what they're eating? She didn't harm much. I have a few mystery meals. Yeah, oh good, Shep. Shep is so sweet. Who made your dress, Kaylee? Oh, do you like it? When I saw the ruffles, I just couldn't resist. You want to see to your girl. Don't be mean to her. She made you a dress that looks like you bought it in a store. Oh my god, these bitches. What a vision you are in your fine dress. I bet this is the guy they need to talk to. Of course, your daddy tells me it takes the space of a schoolboy's wink to get you out of it again. Ooh, he's coming in to stand up for Kaylee, isn't he? I like this man! Yes, I do! I cannot abide useless people. Yes. This is totally the guy they need to talk to. I like him. Oh, maybe that's the guy. I don't know. Either way, I just hope the guy that saved Kaylee is around because I like him. Ah, Nora. Didn't realize you were going to this party. It's the only party. Ha! <laughs> She's so pissed. Oh, wow. He's holding her so tight. I'm sure you won't mind if I ask Nora the favor of a dance. Oh, he's so... You, of course. I hate the fa I hate how tight he's holding on to her. That is too possessive, dude. It's not okay. You're a brave man. I know it's mine. Ew. Ew, yeah. Don't like him. Don't like him at all. I'm not saying the 8004 is hard to repair. It just ain't worth it. It's a fine machine. You just oh. keep it tuned. Cybers. Ah! By the way, the 8010 is the same machine. They just changed the plating. Hope no one noticed. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! That made me so happy! I love that so much. She's finally getting like adored and respected by all the men. It's great. It makes me so happy. Oh, I love her. Money changed hands, which makes her mine tonight. No matter how you dress her up, she's still. Oh. Oh no. Oh no. It's over. You can't punch someone at a party, Mal. There has been a challenge. I hope you're prepared, Captain. Are you all talking about a fight? Oh, it's fine. Let's get out of here. It's not a fist fight, Mal. Are they gonna have to fence or some stupid? Any gentleman here can give you use of a sword. Use of a sword. <laughs> no! Oh, sh. Well, this is a joke. He'll need a second. What's that? I'll take on the job. He fights if you refuse. Wait, so it means that that guy could f sword fight in place of Mal? Is that what that means? Wow, things escalated quick. So you punch a guy, and that just means you, you have to duel with a sword? <laughs> we have until the morning, correct? Do you know what lodging he's in? Some of you seem to be misapprehending my purpose in being here. You're here to make sure that we don't do what these men are keen on doing. Penny for the smart lady. We'll just settle in till this blows over. Oh, hi. they have Kaylee. <laughs> hi, hi. <laughs> this is a lot funnier and a lot less scary than last episode. I'm having fun watching this one. The last one kind of freaked me out. Made a nice justification for the punch. I insulted you. I hit her. Seemed like the thing to do. Why'd this get so complicated? Because you guys love each other. Well, join us after he wins the duel. Yeah. And what if he don't win? Oh, Kaylee. Kaylee's so naive. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> Who's that then? Jesus. They're going to have to kill them all now. They're going to have to kill them all. Sure. I got a secret. She's doing an accent. Anyone off flight in colony knows better and to talk to strangers. Holy moly! She just pulled out a cognitive accent. That's great. Call me if anyone interesting shows up. <laughs> wow! How the f How the f she just knew? It takes less than a pound of pressure to cut skin. You know that? They teach you that in Horror Academy? Be nice to her right now. I need to get back. Oh, God. He barely taught him anything. Oh, God. That wasn't enough practice. <laughs> People are standing so close by. I'd be like, I'll stay. Oh. He thinks he's doing well, doesn't he? He's been toying him. <laughs> Stop swinging with your shoulder. She told you. Don't fall for it. Don't fall for it. Don't fall for it. This doesn't seem fair for a punch in the face, honestly. Like, what kind of psycho wants to kill a man for punching him in the face? Atherton, wait. I'll stay here. Exclusive to you, just let him oh, live. No. Oh. Yeah, yeah. 
You set this up. Oh, I should have uglied you up so no one else would want you. Kill her. Kill her. Kill him. I mean, sorry. Kill him. Just kill him now. You willing to fight that hard to protect my property? I'll have it in your hold before midnight. No. Maybe go to a doctor first, though. Oh, you guys don't need the plan. It's going to be okay. You don't... You guys don't need a plan! I wasn't going to stay, you know. Why is that? Mm. Someone wants to keep Kaylee out of trouble. <laughs> I know why things are here. Why would I want to leave Serenity? Can't think of Aww. a reason. Oh my god, they have to move cows! <laughs> Wow, could we really get more Western than moving cattle? <laughs> well, that was such a sweet and uh, heartwarming episode. It's it's really nice to start to see um, Inara and Mal kind of express their feelings for each other a bit more. Because in the past few episodes, we've just seen like tension between the two of them. And you know that there might be something there. Um, but we didn't really get to see their actual chemistry as actors together. And in this episode, we got to see that a bit more. And I, I really like that. It makes me feel a little bit more invested in their relationship, which is good. And I just love seeing Kaylee happy. So it was really nice to see her have fun at the party and all those men respect her. That was really cute. That made me happy. All in all, this was such a fun episode and I'm so excited to see where it goes from here. Now that they have a bunch of cattle on the ship, like, are you kidding me? I don't... <laughs> I mean, maybe the next episode will just pick off with them delivering the cattle and that won't really be a big important piece, but um, that seems like crazy to have all those bulls and cattle on the ship, but oh well. But for now, that's all I have for you guys in this video. I really hope you enjoyed it, and if you did, please give it a thumbs up because it really helps me out and lets me know that you guys like this kind of content. Let me know your thoughts in the comments down below and anything else you might like me to watch next, and subscribe if you want to. Until next time, stay golden. Bye.